to JTML 9681 LP. I'm your host, JTML 9681, and we are still playing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Time for the Nintendo DS. This is part 40 of our adventure. <clears throat> so, wrapping up, everyone's aware of their duties. By golly, yes! I'm all ready to go. Good. Those of you investigating the hidden land, those of you spreading r word of the true state affairs, I expect you organize your teams accordingly. Let's go. Well, we need to go to the hot spring, get Torkoal. Think we have to go through the waterfall cave. Before we do that, we got some reading to do. Alright, I believe it is number nine where we left off at. Back home. We just got back from an expedition now. Oh my gosh! Am I exhausted? Ooh, this expedition left a big impression, blah, 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 blah. Especially at Bogbound Lake. Oh my gosh! It moved me in ways I cannot express. But if I write any more details, Oomxie would be upset! That wouldn't be good! Eek! This was the best expedition I have attended. Oh, I hope I can go with everyone again. Oh my gosh, Dusk Noir. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! The famous Dusk Noir came to the guild! Plans to stay Treasure Town. Gotta talk to him! He's wise, courteous, handsome! Oh, that is what. Oh, good. Where's Grovile? The whole guild is now searching for Grovile! Bite Tug Trio and I searched Crystal Cave! But our search ended up nothing. Where could Grovile be? But he must be caught no matter what! That's silly, Bidoof. He was no help. Not only that, but he even brought a crystal as a souvenir. That reminds me. When we were leaving Crystal Cave, I caught Bidoof grinning to himself. Now that I think about it... Oh my gosh! That was him grinning about that crystal. I never suspected that he could leer in such an eeky way. It's another new discovery. Total Shocker. Oh my gosh! It's been one shocking thing after another lately. Turns out Grove Bile is a wanted outlaw, blah 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 blah. Dust Noir also came from the future with them. There are so many unbelievable events. Dust Noir vowed to catch Grove Bile on his own. I'm sure that he that Dust Noir will honor his pledge. We have to leave everything to him. Those kids. Everyone, including myself, is down in the dumps. I've thought about why the guild is lacking energy lately. The answer is easy. It's because Team Deltoy is missing. I didn't realize how lonely it would be without them. Chatted has been very ill-tempered lately and prone to annoying outbursts. But that's also because he misses those kids. Oh, I hope they're safe. Those kids. for Baidoof. Awesome expedition. We're back home, back for an expedition. Yup, yup. It was my first expedition. I was scared something awful, but here I am back. Expedition was inspiring. We got to see Fogbound Lake and other stuff. But what sticks in my mind mostly, by golly, was reaching base camp with JT O'Malley's team. It was the first expedition for all three of us. I ended up causing a lot of trouble for them, though. But we helped each other the best we could. And we finally made it to base camp. I swear that had to be one of the happiest times. Oh, if it wasn't for Dean Delta, this expedition wouldn't have been quite so fun. I truly really have to thank them. No sleep. I'm 
feeling foggy if you're not getting my fair share of sleep. I share a room with Louder and Corefish. Lately, Crow Dunk's taking to sleeping in, into our room for some shut eye every so often. Well, that Crow Gunk, he usually beds down by that swamp cauldron of his, but lately he's taken to sleeping here. Just the other day, I was surprised to find Crow Gunk sleeping nearby, by golly. And he mumbled, hehehe. <laughs> Morning there, Bayouf. I mean, I don't want my day to start that way. That surely put a scare in me. Yup, yup. No, I can't sleep because of Crowdunk. P.S. The Great Dusk Noir sure is mighty wise. Not only that, he shows respect to everyone, even me. My God, you have to respect someone like that. The Guild at Night. Thanks to Crowdunk, I haven't been able to get a good night's sleep. There's nothing to do when you're awake at night. So I took a stroll through the guild. I glanced at Total and JT O'Malley, but they were dead asleep. I reckon they must be exhausted from their training. I didn't peek in Chimek on some floor's room. They, that'd be downright rude. Yup, yup. Diary? You wanted me to peek? I surely cannot do that. It's just not done. Who could live like that? And sneaking to the guildmaster's room was too scary. Now that chatted, by golly, that one gave me quite a start. So, Diary, what do you reckon chatted sleeps? Surprise, surprise, he sleeps on the top rug of the guild's entry ladder. When I crept nearby, he thought I was trying to run away. So he wildly attacked me. I'm still sore all over. Crystal Cave was sure lived up to its name. It surely was a pretty place. It was so pretty I couldn't help helping myself to a crystal. It's my own precious treasure. But when everyone found out, all I got was a bunch of grief. Shocking news. It's shocking, by golly! I don't really understand it, not totally. Pokemon can come from the future? Is that possible? But it was the Great Dust Noir who claimed it, so you gotta reckon. This is all so confusing, it makes my head hurt. But I reckon I'd best focus. <laughs> because now is the time that we we need to help out the word to Azelf and his buddies. Grovile's scheme cannot continue. I gotta spread the rumor thick. Very sad. Oh, awful long time gone! By since that Team Down Toy disappeared. I hope that Total and JT O'Malley are doing fine. After we became buddies in the guild and all, I was counting on going expo exploring with them more down the road. Oh, if I miss them, I surely do miss them. Okay. It's a bit of time. Well, let's get going looking for jobs and such. And getting our team members back. So 10, 10th floor, 15th floor, and whatever floor the missing Pokemon is on in the northern desert. Oh my goodness, you're safe. Oh, thank mercy. I was worried. You're back without a scratch. This is wonderful. I shouldn't be sobbing. I should be strong. Welcome back. We were worried about you. No one seemed to know where you went. It's good to see you're safe home. And good to have you shop with us again. It's been a long time. <laughs> Gummy. Red gummy. Baby. 
bay leaf claw. Meowth claw, or whatever. Alright, folks, that's gonna be it for part 40 of Pokemon Mr. Dungeon Explore the Time for the 10th DS. Not too much of gameplay, just preparing and journal reading. Part 41, we will start our training in the dojo again. And we'll start doing more jobs. So until then, this is JTML and S681 signing off. I hope you join me for part 41. I'll see you guys then.